In this video, I'm gonna be discussing whether you can send cold emails with MailChimp. The short answer is no. Sending cold emails through MailChimp is against the terms of service and they will ban your account. But even if it wasn't against the terms of service, it still would be a terrible idea for many, many reasons that I'll get into in this video. I'm George, I'm the founder of Email Chaser and let's get into this video. The first reason why sending cold emails through MailChimp is a bad idea is because when you send your emails through their service, in the from section of your emails, it will say something like via MailChimp or just MailChimp. So your recipients are gonna know that the emails they're sending are not personalized one-to-one -one communication, which is the entire point of cold email. They're gonna know that you're using a tool like MailChimp to send a high volume of emails to many people, and they're not gonna to wanna to respond to your emails because it doesn't look personalized. The second reason why you don't want to send cold emails with MailChimp is because MailChimp has their own email servers and as a result, the big email service providers such as Gmail and Outlook, they know when an email is being sent from, e from MailChimp and they'll recognize the IP address from their email server or servers. And as a result, they're just going to send your, cold, or your emails to the promotions tab or spam because typically the only people sending emails from MailChimp's servers are people who are sort of selling stuff that can be marketers. And as a result, those aren't the kinds of emails that email service providers want to show in the pri primary inbox of their users. The third and final reason why you don't want to use MailChimp to send your cold emails is because it's against the terms of service. You're not allowed to do it. They don't want you doing it. And as a result, you're going to get your account banned and it's just not worth it. Instead, you want to use a specialized cold email software like Email Chaser to send your cold emails. I'm going to go into my Email Chaser account now to show you what that looks like. I'm inside my Email Chaser account. And as you can see, once here, you're able to create a campaign and that's how you launch your cold email campaign. One key thing to understand about Email Chaser is that you're still sending your emails from your Google or Microsoft email accounts. As you can see, if you click the connect your sender email box, it brings up this page and it allows you to connect your Gmail or Outlook accounts. So that's either Google Workspace or Microsoft 365. So the actual email sending is still happening from your Google or Microsoft email accounts. And that's actually a good thing because Google and Microsoft have the most trusted email servers in the industry, meaning that if you're sending your cold emails from your Google or Microsoft email accounts, they're more likely to hit the primary inbox and not spam. Additionally, when you send cold emails from Google or Microsoft email accounts, they look personalized. They don't have sent from MailChimp or sent from SendGrid or anything like that in the from section. It just looks normal. So your recipients will think that you're sending just them an email and that's gonna help your response rate. If you like this video, then subscribe to our YouTube channel. We create new videos every week about cold email and sales. If you wanna start sending cold emails yourself, then I recommend that you sign up for a free email chaser account. I hope to see you in the next video.